Welcome back to the Grew Garden Project. Today we're going to learn about care and maintenance of your plants. I hope you all have been enjoying your training thus far and have been listening to everything that Agriman has been saying and all your plants are well taken care of. Let's get ready to take care and maintain our plants. A great way to keep moisture in your soil is to add a layer of mulch. Now mulch is simply a layer of dried grass or dried wood or any substance that will allow your soil around your plant to maintain moisture, to stop weeds from growing and also to keep the nutrients within the soil. Today we have an example of dried grass clippings. Everybody should have dry grass around you, whether it's from your own yard or from your neighbor's yard. And what you simply do is you take it and form a layer around the base of your plant and that's it. Your soil is going to remain more moist, you're not going to have as much weeds as you usually would and it's going to keep the nutrients like the Nutrex or your blue corn or whatever you put in your soil within the area and your plant is going to grow healthy, strong and even more nutritious. So this is just a simple way to keep moisture in your soil add a layer of mulch. One of the methods of maintenance is staking. Now what we have here is a sweet pepper plant and it has a stake. A stake is simply a piece of wood and we tie it to the young pepper plant so that when it grows big like this and it has the fruit on it, it helps support the weight of the plant. So you want to make sure and stake your plants from the young stage and you don't just stick them in the ground. You stick them close to the stem and then you use a piece of string. This is grocery twine or you could use wire or thread or whatever works for you but make sure and secure it to the stem of the plant so that when it grows older or it matures you get big fruits and it wouldn't fall over and break and you could enjoy a bountiful harvest. Watering is one of the most important care and maintenance steps that you can take for your plants. We recommend that you either water early in the morning or late in the evening. When you are watering try your best to water around the plants to avoid water and dirt splashing on the underneath of your leaves to tell if your plant needs water just look at it is it looking droopy is it looking wilted if your plant looking healthy or it not looking droopy or wilted another way you can know if it needs water is either take your finger or a stick and send it two inches into the soil when you take it back out is it dry or is it moist if it's dry add water immediately if it's moist then you could probably wait another day before watering water is the most important thing that your plant will need so be sure don't skip this step thank you very much and be sure to take care of your plants